Burma at one point was described as the rice bowl of Asia. But now it's all like gone. This is a landscape that if you were able to see from the air, it could sometimes give you the false illusion that this is the country that is glorious and this is a peaceful country. But there is, of course, when you finally get to the ground level, you will realize that there is something brewing. Well, this country has been isolated from the outside world since the 60s. And as a result, it makes it a very interesting place you're in another world. Do you think of yourself as a politician? Yes, of course I'm a politician. It strikes me that you've gone beyond that and that... You know, I think politicians who think that they've gone beyond being politicians are very dangerous. That's where authoritarianism comes in. I'm just an ordinary politician. Am I allowed to film in, in Yangon? Uh. <laughs> Am I? You are not. So do you think they're watching me because I'm filming? Yeah. People have been arrested and thrown into prison for doing much less than filming. They tied me up, they hang me upside down on the tree. My nose stopped bleeding. Maybe an hour or more later, my eyes and ears stopped bleeding. I would love to see Burma one day become the kind of country where you can speak read, write poetry the way your heart tells you to do it. <laughs>